first biology class. So, in this class, we are going to study about various things which are related to our topic. So, before going to all these things, I want to introduce the stream first that currently you are you all are joined. That is science. So, before going to biology, I want to introduce science first. And nextly, what is biology? And nextly, what is botany? And what is zoology? So, so, what is science? So, our first question is, what is science first? If we talk about science, it is a very vast thing. That means your all surroundings. That means your total nature is included in it. Everything. If you question everything, then your answer is related to a science. It is related to a logic. So all these things, you may talk about your physics, you may talk about mathematics, you may talk about sociology, you may talk about physiology, you may talk about history. All these things are related to science. I just want to classify all these things. So first, science. So, what is science? What is the definition of science first? If we try to define science, it is an experimental knowledge based on number of observations. So, if we talk about science, then it is only based on a number of experiments. That means it is a systematical thing through which we get into a number of observations and through it we get concluded to a certain thing. We found proving it. Through science, we get proofs. Everything is related to an experiment. So, if we split the term science, if we just split it, first one is S. S means your system. First one is your system. Next one is your C. C means your comprehension. Next one is your comprehension. If we talk about I, I means your investigation. Next. S, C, I, then E. E means your exploration. Next one is your N. N means your nature. Next one is your C. C means your causes. And last one is your E. E means your effect. If we split all these things, we get that science is a systematic, comprehensive, investigative, experimental based exploration in which we explore to our nature with its cause and effect. It is the definition of science through which we get a systematic, comprehensive, investigative, exploration answer through which we get into the nature and its causes and effects. So, it is all about your science first. Nextly, the classification of science. If we try to classify science, if you try to classify the total stream science, then we mainly classify it into Three categories. 
So the first thing which is related to your classification of tiles, first one is your social size. And second one is your natural sense. And third one is your abstract sense. So, in classification, we get three types of signs. First one is your social sense, next one is your natural sense, and last one is your abstract sense. If we talk about social science, the total part of social science is included your past things. That means you may talk about history, you may talk about some types of religions, you may talk about some type of uh, politics, all these things. So political science and history, all these things are related to your social science. Next thing, the natural science. If we talk about natural science, then natural science is included all the natural things but it again divided into two types that means it again divided split into two types one is you know physical science and another one is your biological science What is your biological sense? If we talk about physical science, it is totally included all the non-living things. That means the things have no life. There is no life in it. So all these things which are related to physical science are related to the non-living things. And biological science is related to all the living things. That means here we are going to study about our physics, chemistry, all these things. But in biology, we are going to study about life. If we split the term biology, then it is divided into two Greek words. That means it is introduced from two Greek words. In biology, I again repeat all these things. I again uh, try to uh, get total concept of biology from which it arises and the splitting of all these streams and the related classification towards it. If you talk about biology, it is related to two terms. One is your bios, another one is your logos. And your bios means your life and logos means your study. That means in Greek word, bios means your life and logos means your study. So study of life is always the one of your biology. So if we split again the biology, that means if we classify the biology, then we again classify it into two types. One is your botany and another one is your geology. If we talk about botany, botany is all only things which are related to your plant size and geology is the animal size that means we again divide into botany and geology and we just a uh, couple of stages later we just talk about all these th things clearly towards your biology and its things nextly abstract science if you talk about abstract science it is only related to your mathematical knowledge that means it is only the mathematical knowledge which are based on this science. That means it is simply the numericals and the arrangement of numerical to the mathematics which is related to your abstract science. So, this is some of the classification of science and brief explanation of your science through which you are entered into the subject that is your biology and from the subject biology we are entering into the topic that means botany and from botany we are going to study about a number of classification and number of branches through which the dealings of your biology takes place so hope this session is helpful to all of you and the total class is helpful to all of you so till stay tuned thank you